Hey what's up guys in today's video I am going to show you how to connect your Firebase to your Android app manually. So first of all you have to create a new Android Studio project. Select MPT activity, click on the next button and give name any name to your Android Studio project. And you have to I am going to select Java language and click on the finish button. You can see that my Android Studio project have been created. Now you have to open your Chrome, type here Firebase, press enter and open the Firebase website. Click on go to console and if you are opening this first time, maybe you have to log in with your email and password. These are my recent projects that I have created in my Firebase. You have to click on create new and Firebase project. Uh, give any name like cubicsol123, press continue button and again click on continue button uh, sorry before create, uh, uh, click on this button you have to select this uh, default account for firebase and uh, click on create project it will take a little bit time maybe for 10 to 15 seconds you can see that uh, firebase showing me this notification that your new project is ready click on continue button and it will take you to the control panel of your Firebase project. Now, because I want to connect my Android app with my uh, with my Firebase database, so I you have to click on this button, Android. And uh, here you have to give your package name of your Android app. To find the package name for, of your Android app, go to Android Studio uh, project and uh, inside your main activity, this is your package name. Copy this one and uh, again go to your Firebase press paste button I am going to uh, because this is optional uh, the, nickname, the nickname of your app so I am going to leave this and now you have to enter SHA1 certificate of your Android app to do this again go to Android Studio click on this Gradle click on app Android and signing report when you will click on this uh, in this section of your Android Studio it will show you the your SHA1 uh, certificate uh, so you can see that here when you will scroll down this this is your SHA1 key you have to copy this control C and uh, go to your again this section and paste this key and click on register app after this you have to do second step Download this google-services.json file, click on this button and I am going to download this inside my cubicsol folder uh, in the desktop. Press save button and your file will be downloaded. Uh, I am going to click on show in folder, right click on this file, copy this file, go to your android studio and uh, let me minimize this. Okay and now you have to select uh, project uh, view of your uh, Android application click on this inside your app folder right click on your app folder and press paste button and again press ok button so you can see that my google dash services.json file have been pasted inside my app folder again change this view to uh, Android view and go to your uh, firebase project press next button now you have to add these dependencies, these libraries to your Android app. First of all, you have to copy this and go to your Android Studio and minim inside your build.gradle project level file. Click on this because this file is uh, automatically added. So I'm not going to add this because but if this line is missed in your Android Studio project, you have to add this line. Again, go to your Firebase and uh, copy this dependency go to your android studio project and paste this inside this section again go to firebase and uh, uh, make sure to uh, that your this library is also maven repository is also added in your android studio project copy this one and uh, go to android studio and you can see that it has already been added in my uh, uh, build.gradle file. Now you have to again click on uh, this one. 
apply plugin you have to copy this and open your android studio project and uh, in your build.gradle app level file you can see that this file is at is already have been added in my project so you did not need to add this file again go to your fire uh, firebase and now uh, you have to copy this line and uh, you have to paste this line inside your uh, below this line press enter and press paste button again go to your firebase project and copy this dependency and paste this inside your this dependencies section press enter and press paste button again go to firebase and copy this uh, also copy this dependency and paste it inside your uh, this section now you uh, all the steps are already are almost completed again press next button now it is checking if uh, whether your app have been corrected or not when you will run this your android app by using this section select this app and when you will run the app your app will be automatically connected if you have any question related uh, if you are facing any problem or if you have any question about this topic you can ask me in the comment section and we will try to answer your question and finally thanks for watching